Whew. All right. Hey, everybody. Good morning. How y'all doing today? Hopefully well. Uh, let's see. So today we're going to do some more Silent Line. I think we might actually beat it today. Um, so yeah, that's, uh, that's the plan for today. No, we're not doing that. Drag down like so. All right, cool. Down the stream health so I can actually see that. Cool, cool, cool. Whew, how's everybody doing this morning? Hopefully good. I'm doing okay. I ate a shit ton of food last night. It was basically a big bowl of corn and salad. So, I'm like overly full to the point that I'm like not hungry. Uh, which is unusual for me. Okay. Uh, let's see. Regain. Load game versus... Or load game, yep. That's what we want to do. Double check our levels. Our levels seem to be okay. Cool. Whew. All right, so I don't remember what the hell was going on the last time. I think last time we played this, um, I think last time we had finished the B-rank uh, arena and gotten a bunch of new parts. So let's actually take a look at our ACs and see what we're working with here. Right, we've got the dual machine gun set up. We've got the heavy sniper one, which didn't work for shit. And then we've got the Old Faithful, basically. Alright, cool. Whew. Let's grab Old Faithful and continue on. I'm assuming, yep, we did all of that. So we've only got three left, and then it's going to open up Extra Arena once we beat the game. I'm surprised Extra Arena isn't just in it right away. Baconate are only the most skilled ravens advanced past this pilot's current level. The challengers that await are hardened veterans eager to take advantage of the unprepared. Will the next matches prove too difficult? No. <laughs> but since we can't even do matches, let's go do some missions, shall we? Neo Central Destroy AI Prototype. High end MTs. Interesting. It has come to our attention that Mirage is <laughs> I'm dying. Not really dying, but you know. Made up entirely of AI controlled units. Hmm. Kisaragi has been assisting them in this effort. Isn't that the plot to Gundam Wing? Kisaragi's involvement does not come as much of a surprise. The company has been struggling to stay on its feet, and oh, this arrangement is most here. likely a windfall for them. We're sending you into Kisaragi's underground armory to the I... manufacturing efforts. Depending on how long it takes to actually like beat the game. We might do all the extra stuff on this stream. We might not. We might just do a short stream at some point later on. We'll see. Heavy resistance is anticipated, so we've arranged to have a resupply vehicle accompany you. Oh, geez, this sounds like trouble. As much damage on the facility as possible. Hmm. I will accept this mission, and I will commence this mission. Having the resupply will be nice, just because I've got the low uh, ammo energy weapons. Actually, I mean, is it just going to follow with us the whole damn time? How's it going, Raven? The supply vehicle can recharge your AC twice. So basically click on it when we want more ammo. Still nothing. Oops. All right, two shots. Okay, this isn't too bad. There we go. Whoops. I'm trying to stay mobile here. seem to be doing all right, but there's a hell of a lot of people hanging around here. They're not 
making it too difficult to, you know, get them. I'm assuming there's got to be parts around here somewhere. Is that a part? It is not a part. It looked like a like a arm shield or something. Who knows? Maybe there is one over. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's keep going. I'm trying to use this shoulder one. I should probably use those on the less mobile ones, but... Because, oh boy, those MTs are actually... Uh, really powerful. Alright, there's one more over there, but I want to go explore down this way where we started over here because I feel like we're at the point in the missions where we're going to be running into um, you know items just on the ground doesn't look like it here over here's another door oh that's the resupply truck so I'm letting him through that's cool all right, let's head on over this way. There was... Oh, pfft. That was it? I thought you were a full health one. I thought I was actually going to have to... unload into you for a bit. I hope the resupply truck is coming back. I mean, let's see. Does it appear on our map? It does not. Which means that when we want that resupply, we're going to have to actually go back and look for it. Having to blow through all these is kind of, uh, kind of annoying, to be perfectly honest. Oh, wow. The howitzer does work if you can fucking hit him with it. Jesus. I'm really I'm really letting them hit me here. Oh well this is first game back after a while, so it's understandable that I wouldn't be at the top of my game yet. Wow, you survived all that? Damn. Oh. They must have, like, been moving in and out, basically. Alright, maybe it's time for that resupply? What do you guys think? Probably. Eh, I've got a full chain gun. We'll see where this goes. We'll see what happens. Because as, as it stands, it looks like I'm going to have to go all the way back to nearly the beginning of the level to get anything out of... Okay, everything about this says AC fight. Looks like we can drop down one level. Maybe it is time to get that resupply. Yeah, we'll take we'll take a second to get that repl that blah blah that repl blah resupply before. Where are you, friendly truck? Get the truck over here, ha ha ha! Get it? And can I ruin this stream more with more bad truck puns? It's a trucking horrible time. What you doing back here? Oh, hey. Refills my armor, too. Perfect. I'm comfortable with this. I have a feeling once we drop down there, we're going to just basically be dropped into, like, 
a big group of them. Um, hopefully this, this fucker will uh, catch up with us here. Um, but uh, I have a feeling dropping down there with the chain gun and the EO out uh, will uh, probably help tremendously. So it looks like we can stop halfway. Is there anything going on on this thing? Nope. What about the next drop? Alright, here we go. Shit, the EO is putting in work. Yeah, buddy. Okay, that wasn't too bad. It was not too bad. This damn EO so eager to get kills. I wish you could see the damage those things do. There's nothing over there. So what's in there? Oh shit, an army of... Army of MTs. Okay. Okay, they're dead, they're dead, no! It's fine. Get him off, he's learned his lesson, he's learned his lesson! The fact that the EO core is like... actually managed to do a ridiculous amount of damage while also being able to refill their health and being completely, like, just, you know, kill or not kill mode is, uh, pretty crazy. Okay, that one's dead. Where's the next one? That one's dead. Ooh. You got missiles, huh? Alright, you need to refill your ammunition, Mr. EO Core. Where's my way out? Where's my door? Is there no door? Oh. It was literally five degrees to the left of where I started looking. Yeah, having an EO core in this game kind of feels like easy mode. Over there on the other side of all this stuff. Where did where does it go? Oh, I guess there's uh, uh, doors right there they can get into and out of. <clears throat> Man, the EO core is perfect for this. Like... I should switch over to my laser cannon just to save that uh, machine gun ammo in case I run into an AC. Uh, because as it stands, those... Watch, speak of the devil? Or is this just a loading screen? It's acting like an AC. Doing its best to stay behind the damn... Time to break out the howitzer. Come on, buddy. Oh, that was it. So there was an AC fight there. That's that's fine. Why am I having issues? Oh, another AC fight. Well, shit. He's got that dual laser. Ooh, that was a good. Uh, that was a good howitzer hit. I hit him mid air with that thing. Oh fuck you! There's a backup AC. Whoops! If I could keep him in my sights for more than a second. He's almost, he's almost dead. I'm almost dead. Woo! Did we get him? 
That's all we gotta do. That's all we gotta do. We gotta hit him a few times. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Whew. So here's hoping there's nothing else on the... Another one? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. All right, we gotta get the fuck out of here. All right, now what? No, 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 no. Stop fucking firing at me. Oh, no! <laughs> oh. Oh, that's a fucking tough one. So they just keep coming in forever? What's the deal? Damn. That's, uh... That's an incredible pain in the ass. Oh, well, we'll save scum that really quick. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, let's save scum this. Oops, and I just saved instead of low. God damn it. God damn it. I'm just not on my game today. Oh, well. That's what I get for starting out right away. Well, I guess we're not doing that mission again. But I'm starting to have... Serious questions about the fidelity and abilities of the Baconator here with the current parts setup. If that thing does 20, that thing does 20, that thing has 40, but it weighs more than anything. Like, I'm almost wondering if switching to the Karasawa and taking this uh, shoulder piece off. I went the wrong damn way to unequip. And there's no just like quick unequip button, unfortunately. Still overweight by about 500. I wonder if maybe this is the time that we should be starting to worry about a new leg setup. Because we got those heavier legs, 51 versus 53. 53 is a little better. Moving ability, 425 to 396. That's not too bad. This thing... This actually has the best... Hmm. Okay. So we've got a heavier leg piece now. Go. The lighter weight head. Where's that one with a thousand? That's better, but oh boy, does that weigh a lot more. That's the one. But we're not worried about that. Uh, 59, 97, 55, 33. Let's see. Well, getting rid of you. Actually, equipping that do it? No, that puts us way over still. Removing that, we're still overweight by... Quite a bit, actually. Okay. Um. Hum. So it looks like we can't build something around the Karasawa, but maybe we can get close. <clears throat> in terms of damage. 1,566. That one's probably close, but you can't lock on with that damn thing. That might be pretty good. I mean, the... the the round fire is really slow. So what if we... Triple hand shotgun. What if we switch over to... A machine gun build on the hand. How much damage does that do? 328 and 300 is an incredible amount of damage. Um, 1180 and 80 is still the best. The problem is the... The reticle is so damn small it's hard to use while moving. I mean, there are those, like, shoulder-mounted pulse cannons we could use. I kind of want something that hits harder. I want an energy thing that hits harder. So maybe actually go with that. I don't know. Hmm. We're still underweight with that, so that's pretty good. The machine gun on the arm there uh, will be useful for dealing with ACs. 
And then with this, we can switch out. Let's see, charge drain. Is that still the best charge drain I have? 35? Yeah, it is. Okay. Can we equip? Nope, we can't equip that. Not worried about... That's a that's a better trade up there. 433, 155, but 300 rounds. I would rather have that, even though the range is better on that one. That's probably our best bet for just regular missions, honestly. But we'll stick with this build for now. Let's see. It's rated good. I guess since we saved over the other one, we'll do another quick save here. Save complete. And since we failed the mission, will it let us do it again? It does let us do it again. Huh. Why not? Yep, okay, we get it. No, shit. Man, I've just been having problems every time we played Armored Core, man. And let's commence mission. Whew, not too bad, though. Honestly, this has probably been my favorite um, Armored Core game to play. Right, the movement on these things are not perfect. Why aren't you firing at the things right in front of me? Alright, there we go. <coughs> the Exceed Orbit gameplay seems to revolve around, like, how quickly can you put it away once it's done its job to not waste the ammo? Which, granted, refills anyways, so. But, like, as it stands, I've been able to use these things to just completely avoid using almost any, like, ammo. So let's sit here and let it refill for a second. Alright, so now that I know what to expect, I'm definitely going to want to jump my ass. Um, that was a waste. Oh, well, it was, uh, you know, an energy cannon, so it's free. Alright, exceed orbit 30. Trying to see how many seconds it takes the Exceed Orbit to fill back up to full. Exceed Orbit for the win. Look at this. Look at how stupid this is. Like just having no problems with those things. And, like, the ability to just walk into a room with those things and take on multiple enemies is, uh, unparalleled. Alright, let's go find our truck. Just to help it move up, to be perfectly honest. It's back over this way somewhere. Destroying those extra things will help the truck move up more quickly. As long as there's more or less a straight line, it's not going to be stuck going around everything. All right, and it was over here where I magically found the truck last time, if I remember correctly. Come on, truck. Let's truck and go. It's over here, I wonder. Is this the 
I don't think that's the where we came in in the beginning, is it? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, no, no. I'm gonna just watch this thing move. Man, the fact that these quad legs still move so well, despite being like the heaviest ones that we could buy, or at least the heaviest ones that I've bought to this point, is uh, kind of crazy, honestly. Bounce, 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 bounce. Come on, truck. Get a truck and move on. Man, this thing is uh, not great. I think the idea is you're supposed to, like, be fighting your way through with the truck behind you. Since I'm, I'm pretty sure it's functionally invincible. Come on, truck. Come on, truck. Come on, truck. What are you caught on, truck? Really? You, like, seriously have to babysit this thing. What is it going to do for the, the parts where it drops down, I wonder? Probably nothing. It's probably just going to stop. Oh, I was in your way? I'm sorry. It's really sad that I'm the one holding you up. <clears throat> I'm definitely going to try and use this, or er, conserve this back chain gun for those AC fights. Um, hey, I made something explode. Uh, just because of how much damage it does. Like, the amount of damage it does, like, completely outweighs... Mm, excuse me. The amount of damage it does completely outweighs uh, the cost of ammunition or anything associated with that. Shoot stuff up for no reason. Just waste money, you know. Waste money, bounce around. Come on, truck. No, open the door. Come on, hurry the truck up, you truckin' son of a mother trucker. Go truck yourself. Um, I don't know. Can I ride on you? Watch that kill it. Nope, don't seem to be able to ride on it, unfortunately. All right, so went through. we went through about half of our AP to get here. wondering like I'm, I'm going to fill up here obviously uh, before we go through any more of this but you know what just do it right here while you're on the move no reason we can't do that woohoo oh wow it couldn't fill the machine gun all the way up that's crazy Come on. I want to see it drive over the clip and fall down into the damn uh, next area here. That would be funny. Nope, that's as far as you're going? Okay. Good to know. Those things do a fair amount of damage, honestly. And it looks like the next one's in the hall over here. <clears throat> and you bet your ass before we get to the last part, since we had so much trouble with it, that I'm going to um, go back up and refill my health before I get in there. Come on, EO cores. Shooting at some shit over here in the distance. Okay, that one's down. 
that one's good. All right, let's put those away. Let them refill a bit. Batoop. Every time there's one of these shafts, because I've seen them do it in previous games, I always expect there to be some kind of, like, hidden secret or item or something floating around there. All right, exceed orbit, do the work. Okay, that one's down. Where's the next one? Really? You're like the only one with a machine gun, bro. All right, where is the god? There's the... That's it. Yeah, we're definitely going to refill. Because we're going to go through about half our health getting down here again. Oh, wow. Really doing your best to... Just the amount of damage output a machine gun EO combo does is crazy. Alright, that's where we had the issue. So let's go refill and then come on back down. Let's go! Oh yeah, they like specifically designed it with those shaft... Um, those uh, uh, rests in the middle for people who... Uh, have a lot of energy drain on their cores so that you can get back up here. How funny would it be if he was just there? Just like, I jumped my car down the thing. I hope you appreciate what I've done for you. <clears throat> All right. Taking a little extra time for precaution, but stream safe. We're worried about stream safe, not not anything else. Let's keep on keeping on. Man, even with OP Intensify equipped, it takes a lot to uh, just fly straight up for such a long time. Okay, here's the last one. Drop like a fly. Woohoo! I feel like, because we reach we reach a point where we don't accelerate anymore as we're falling down, but I feel like that wouldn't be the terminal velocity of one of these things that probably weighs, what, like 20 to 30 tons? Actually, no, that's probably way too much. It's probably... The heavier ones are probably around 10 tons. The lighter ones are probably, honestly, with the weight difference in some of these, probably around five to six tons. Actually, that's probably also a very conservative guess. It's probably a lot more than what I'm, what I'm suspecting. All right, any more? Shit, there are more. Oh, well. We use our laser cannon to fight through the rest of the way, y'all. Alright, here it is. Where are you at? Oh, wow, you're... Really, uh, really going for it there, eh? Alright, so in this one, I'm gonna try and fight the one. Because for some reason, these things have a fair amount of health. Alright. So where is it coming from? Probably coming from the front. Alright, no, we've seen this. Alright. We're gonna use EO to keep the fire on him. Jesus, he's really, uh... I haven't even unlocked the thing yet. Is it time-based? Okay, that one's dead. Oh, I had to get two of them. All right, let's get through here before they can... 
What's up? Is this the prototype? prototype yep. Destroyed. That's the prototype I need to destroy. The other one didn't spawn out yet. Oh, that was it? I could have just run in here and unloaded on it the last time? Wow, I feel... Really poor about that one. I guess I should really be paying attention to what I'm supposed to be doing in these missions. Look at how much ammunition I went through. Got a ton of money for... Oh, wow, the AIAC is worth 8000 apiece. So if I destroyed two more of them with energy weapons only and not taken any more damage, I might have come out of that with money. Oh, hey, I got a special reward core part CC... I got a core part and a back part, and unfortunately I didn't see what the what the back part was, but I want to see this core. Where's a core I don't recognize? It's an upgraded version of... Is it an upgraded version of general purpose rigged with a solid ammo EO function? Okay, so this is this is the one that uh, Thunder and I talked about the last time we were here. So it's a solid ammo EO core. EO reload time 24, ammo price 15. Okay, that's really interesting. The fact that it has less AP and slightly more defense points and can carry more, but it weighs a lot more. Okay, that's really interesting. Now let's go see if we can track down the back part I just unlocked. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What is in store for me? Stop me if you see the thing I unlocked. So far I'm not seeing it. Is it this one? Might have been that one. Yeah, must have been that rocket launcher there. Okay. Well, I mean, that's not terrible. It's not the best, but... Is there anything in the way of a right arm? Okay, energy pulse rifle. So that's probably the closest to a right-hand energy machine gun you can get in this game. They had one and two that was, like, super OP and, like, really good. Still rank B. I think I got mail, too. What do we got? Crest, warning. We've just been informed that Mirage has completed their analysis of the information from the controller's data banks. Our main concern is that they may be able to use what they've learned to gain control of the satellite. If that should happen, they would be able to monopolize the silent line and even turn the weapon against us if they wanted. <laughs> We must take measures to ensure that this doesn't happen. Mirage is sorely mistaken if they think we'll just stand by and do nothing, Raven. Oh, nothing. Raven, I hope we can count on your support in this matter. I mean, for the right price, I guess. Alright, so since we actually beat that, let's fucking save. We did it. Kind of. Okay. Come on. Come on, come on. There we go. 22 sorties in. We should hopefully be coming up on... Oh, wow. That closed out... Doing that one closed out all the other missions. Investigate satellite. That price is low. Operation area, space satellite. Explore space satellite. So are they launching us into space? That's crazy. Aw, oh, shit. But before we even consider doing so, a thorough, hands-on search of the premises must be conducted. Okay. We're sending you in to fulfill this objective. Explore as much of the satellite as you can. 60% should be sufficient for our needs. Work quickly and exercise caution. Literally fly through this damn thing. Don't get shot up. Oh, shit. A consort? Consort one is diligent. Oh, they're just giving us a dude. With missiles and a machine gun. All right. Another quad guy. 
Watch him actually be a sleeper agent from Crest who's like, we won't let you do it, and then I have to kill him. Are you going to have to die, Diligent? Oh, yeah, I think we are in space. I'll hold it, Docking Bay S2. Oh, okay. Guess you're supporting us from behind. Return here once your search is complete. Okie dokie. I bet you I get a big fat bonus for finding 100% of it. This seems, uh... Like, too easy to begin with. Something's gonna happen. Oh! Well, there's our first. This is a dead end. That is some crazy-ass elevator. Alright. Oh, hey, our ally is over here. Fighting something? Looks like it. Oh shit, fucking fuck that! We're gonna be relying on the EO cores for this nightmare, I'm assuming. Oh, oh. Right around this corner, yep, you are. Yeah, you are. So there's nothing in these... This place is labyrinthian. And... Oh, I don't have an auto-mapping system. Shit! That explains... No. God damn it. That's, um... Incredibly poor for me. Whoops. Oh, this is cool as fuck. Is that the other AC? Yeah, it is. Wow. It took three shots from this big-ass shoulder-mounted laser cannon. That's kind of crazy. There's something right here, isn't there? Yeah, there is. I gotta get my damn controls down here. Oh, Jesus. Okay, that one's down. Okay, they're firing shell-based weaponry. That's interesting. It looks like this is the end of this. The fact that I don't have an auto-mapping function equipped on this AC is pathetic. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. It's very poor. So I guess I'm just going to do the right hand rule, which if y'all don't know what the right hand rule is, it means basically you keep your right hand along the wall and keep following. Um, and you should, like in a maze, you should eventually get to an exit. Um, I just like focused on something. All right, so this is an elevator. Gate. Ooh. Security units are closing on my position. Oh, well, I fucked up, I guess. Get back to the docking port as soon as possible. So maybe it's a time dimension. There's can't, not much time. Let's can't hurry. tell what the. F can't tell what I was supposed to do here. This place is a maze, and the fact that I don't have an auto mapping function equipped is bad for me. But I'm probably not going to do well because I didn't do the full exploration. This looks like the hallway where we came from. Yep, there's the escape point. Hmm. Okay, well, we we beat it, I guess. Objective achieved. 
We did it probably not very well, but whatever. The music was interesting. Special edition bonus. Just a bonus. Okay, well, we made money. Probably not much money, and we probably wouldn't have done enough to have gotten, like, a part. Yeah. Okay. Map type, no memory. Area, place, and name. Okay. And I think my... Okay. Map type, area, place, and name. Oh... Com type standard, radar function provided. Radar function none. Oh, ECM canceler none, excuse me. So that's still the best head, but now I'm overweight by about 100. We can uh, fix that easily enough by switching back to these. Okay. Man, that's kind of poor that I didn't have access to the mapping function. I'm actually kind of really upset. I'd never thought of that before. It's never been an issue, really, you know? Saving data. Do not remove the memory card. PS2. Save complete. Ah, oh, my eye. All right, let's read that mail. Rank A? Nope. Raven, it won't be long now before Mirage is able to establish a data link with the satellite. What do you think they will do with that much powerful power available at their fingertips? Humankind has a long history of misusing the power entrusted to them. The controller was created in part to prevent this from happening again, but now it seems as though history may repeat itself. What do you think, Raven? Is humankind once again headed down a path of self-destruction? Can they ever learn to wield power responsibly? Um... I don't care. Pay me. All right, defend Mirage headquarters. Oh shit. From helicopters and aerial combat MTs. Defend the rooftop. This is an emergency request. A massive attack has been launched against our main headquarters. We require immediate assistance. Okay. Crest somehow found out about our plans to gain control of the satellite. They've known for a while. Like, you weren't exactly being subtle about it. Both ground and air units. Our security team is overwhelmed. Right now, their efforts are concentrated on the ground attack force. Ooh. This leaves the building's rooftop undefended. One of our dropships is waiting to get you into position. Repel oh, any units minutes. that try to land on the roof. Let's do it. Oh, no consort, huh? I bet you we're going to have to fight an AC, an AC or two here. Won't that be upsetting? Actually, it's not too bad. With an EO core and a machine gun, we should be just fine with these. Don't let any of them land. Can I sit right here? Nope. Damn it. Where's these other ones? Oh, these are the tough ones, too. Okay, there's one down. Yeah, these MTs are actually serious business. Um, come on. Yep, I saw a touchdown. No, I got it. I'm taking care of the problem. Tempting to, anyways. Okay, there we go. We got both of those. Alright, that one's down. Okay, we got that one finally. Alright, so we've got the helicopters that are actually physically trying to land that we need to worry about, and then we've got the the crazy airborne dudes that are flying around trying to shoot me. Oh wow, we we did it apparently. Great. Wait, a second. Wait for what? Oh, that was a hell of a hit. 
What do we got? An AC? No. The the rooftop blew up beneath us. Two of them. She hit. AC target identified. Commencing attack. Where are they? Okay, that one's all flame. All right, I'm worried about the flame one, to be perfectly honest. So we're focused on the flame one first, and then I immediately switch targets here. Up the flame one there. Come on, kill him. Oh shit, so that that this is uh Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, I don't know what the fuck Thunder was talking about. There are some extremely like difficult missions in this in this game. So there are a couple with artificial difficulty out the ass, but uh there's a lot more than a couple. I don't care about that, because I'm going to reload and try again. Looks like with my fucking... Um... AC AC. My arena AC. Alright. So let's see. Assembly... 55, 49, 60. Yeah, this thing's pretty much optimized. No map memory on that. Yeah, I'm not worried about map memory. Alright, let's try this. All right. One more try, and then we're going to have to think about how we're going to approach this. I mean, I guess fighting two ACs is artificial difficulty, especially after the fight we had to go through to get to that point, but... <laughs> yep, no, we get it. I get it. Oh man, the, di the difference in mobility here is um, actually fairly impressive. Come on. That one's down. Just kind of doing the response of this AC versus the other one is crazy. Plus the fact that I can pretty much stay in the air forever. No, it didn't. You don't know what you're talking about. Where is this asshole chasing after me? There he is. All right, he's down. Wow, night and day difference here just from being faster. The turn speed on this thing is crazy too. I gotta stay low though. Like I'm spending so much time in the air. At this point I'm just circling around. I should hopefully at this point have enough. Wow, it, these fucking things are like inside me. about the helicopters than the guys that are actually shooting at me because so far they haven't been able to consistently hit me. Oh. Right, that one's down. Alright, so here's where the game begins. With two machine guns, this should go much more quickly. Okay, there's one down. That was it? Why was that so much harder the other time? Holy shit! That's awesome! Maybe we have to build a bipedal AC to deal with with missions now because the way this is going it seems like I got an S rank. That's crazy the difference between one and the other. Wow. 
All right, I'm going to take my first break here, guys. Uh, just bear with me. Uh, we'll read that mail. Oh, we got... Eh, we'll look at the back part first. CWXDM something. Let's take a look. CWXDM. WC. CWXDM. Okay, it's these dual missile launchers with added ammo. That's cool. All right, cool. I'm taking a short break. I'll be right back. Uh, I'll see you guys in a second. All right. Yo, we back in this. Thanks for bearing with me. <laughs> I'm a fucking idiot. I am a complete goddamn idiot. I never updated the title or anything with this. Okay. Um... Wow, that explains a lot, actually. Okay, here we go. Man, I'm quite stupid. <laughs> Streaming is hard. All right, I need to check this out. Give me a couple seconds here. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at these. Man, what a shame. <sighs> wow. 
Okay. We are definitely having streaming issues here. That explains a lot of what's going on. All right. At least we know now. All right. So we got mail. Let's read the mail. Let's see. We read this one last time. Yo, Tyrant, what's going on? Emissaries, urgent message. Raven, we have an emergency situation on our hands. A state of martial law has been declared in all areas under corporate control. Whew, this heightened state of alert will remain in place until more is known about what caused the recent AI protocol malfunction. Mirage's AI-controlled units, Crest's unmanned fortresses, the satellite weapon, all of them are out of control. Hi, thanks for bugging me. Although the exact cause of the malfunction is still under investigation, it is somehow related to Mirage's attempt to establish a data link with the satellite. Their actions triggered some form of retaliatory response, and it's being spread via the network. We'll notify you again once more details are available. Tyrant, did you get a chance to check out that, uh, that horrifying XCOM stream yet where I killed all my friends? The video on demand should still be on here. Sarah Cross, choices. It would appear that a choice has been made and with it a course of action set in place. I wonder what the end result will be. One thing is for certain, if the choice was made in error, it must be corrected. I don't, what the fuck does that mean? What choice has been made? Been out all night, nice. Sounds like you're taking advantage of your uh, vacation there. You wanna hear why I'm an idiot today? I'm sure you do. Um, I'm an idiot today because when I started uh, streaming today, before I started streaming, I didn't update what the stream had to say. No, not because I killed my daughter in the Silent Hill game. Shut up, I hate you. Um, no, I didn't update it. So now it's never going to show up that I'm actually streaming a game right now, which is kind of annoying. Like, people that are following me will get the, the message, but I'm never going to be able to look in, like, Twitch and look up, like, the Silent Line game and see that I'm streaming it. So, like, look, I'm doing it right now. Uh, Armored Core... Let's take a looky loo. Why isn't why am I getting oh, fucking pain in my ass? Alright. Silent Lime, Armored Core. Oh hey, it finally updated and it's showing that I'm actually streaming now. That's good. Yay! My fuck up wasn't too bad. Whew! Okay. Test new technology. I have to destroy power suits, maybe? Alright, what do we got? Ooh, do I get a better generator? Those two, that string of sentences right there has me like sprung, like super hard. Previously thought to be unattainable. Hell yeah. Okay. We expect you to push your performance levels to the limit. Oh, I'm gonna do it. I'm excited for this. If I get if I get a better generator out of this than what I have right now, if I get like an end game generator, I'm gonna be super excited. Test All right. preparations are almost complete. We'll start with missiles. I'm excited. What does that mean? What does that mean we'll start with missiles? Do your best to avoid being hit. Okay. Am I doing this while I'm in midair? Because if that's the case, that's fine. Are you allowed to fire back on our units? Oh, shit. It's one of these missions. Main system. Engaging combat mode. Alright, am I supposed to just sit on top? Alright, I'm not supposed to fire back, so it's just a matter of moving enough and taking the hit for 43 seconds. Nope, nope, we gotta look the fuck out. Oh, we're having a problems. 
I guess I can just take the hit for another 30 seconds. As long as I hide here, we should be okay. Oh, shit. I almost fell. That would have sucked. Come on. Come on. Y'all ain't got shit. Y'all ain't got shit. Uh, except you're coming up on me now, so... It uh, will probably be better for me to displace again. Session results recorded. We did it. Let's continue. Okay. Now what? Are they still going to be firing at me? Commence my attack on... What, these guys? Okay. Seems to be going all right. All right, we got another one over here. Y'all really ain't shit. Nothing some withering machine gun fire can't handle. Woo! Ah! There's one left! I let it live! I didn't hit it with enough of my anger bullets. Did we do it? Defend target. What? Oh shit! These aren't our units. Okay, there's something flying around super fast. What the fuck? Oh, these are ACs. Or not ACs, these are those uh, flight MTs that are so damn um, good. Where are you at? Where are you at? You're above me. No, you're not. Alright, we've got a lot of fucking fighting to do from the looks of it. We can handle it. Right, there we go, we've got one behind us. Come on, speed in here. I can stay in the air forever, y'all ain't shit. Okay, I see it, there we go, now I can target it. There we go, that's enough to get him. Alright, this one's above me still? Nope. There you are. Yeah, these guys only take, like, a little bit of a hit. Okay, they seem to be more focused on me than anything. I mean, that's fine. Oh boy, these guys are fast. Did I get him? Is he... Nope. He's still up. Now I got him. Okay, did it work? Did I defend everybody? Looks like I did. How long is your vacation there, tyrant? What the fuck is this? What is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, okay. Alright, so this is now just use all the machine gun ammo. And if push comes to shit, this fuck! Ah! Ah! Oh my god! Come on, kill it. We gotta kill it. I'm running out of ammo. I'm gonna have to switch over to my EO core soon. Which will hopefully... Okay, they're taking the shot. Did we get it? Yeah! We got it! Fuck yeah. You don't go back to work till the 30th? Damn. That's legit. Hey, look at that. <laughs> Our arena AC is doing better than everything. Of course, I have to plan on fucking doing that. Of course. God damn it. Okay, no big deal. Special edition 24. Because I saved four of the transports. <laughs> I spent so much money on ammo, though. Nothing wrong with getting paid to sit here and watch me. That's what I like to hear. Alright, we've got more mail. We didn't get any parts, though. Oh, wait! Part reward. Here we go. Congratulations. Oh, wait. This is different. This is different from the generator thing I was trying to get. Your performance reflects well on our operation and will be rewarded. A new product has been made available in the shop. It's the MAM MX MDD AC part. MX MDD. MX MDD. Arms. Ma'am, MX MDD. Oh shit, this is, uh. That looks cool. Its reaction speed is trash. Or wait, is a lower reaction speed better? Is a lower reaction speed better? Hmm. 
You know what, this is definitely worth checking out. <laughs> Look on the calendar for July. Tell me when the license dentist appointment is. Got it. Huh. Got to do something for my wife here. Like, I wonder if the lower reaction speed is actually better, and I've been, I've had the worst part equipped, um, <laughs> this entire time. Let's take a look. All right. So Crest's answer to the blah, blah, blah. Reaction speed is 1,400. Reaction speed on this is 500. I'm wondering if the reaction speed being lower is actually better for our purposes. It's overweight by just a little bit, so we can actually fix that here. You know what? Okay, that's got a reaction speed of 500. Let's switch out these extensions to offset that weight. And let's try that out. Apparently it only has fair performance. AC test. You know what? We're going to try this. We're going to actually try this in a quick arena fight. It's a very quick, like, fight any one of these fuckers. Because if it turns out that having a lower reaction time. That actually makes sense. I swear to God, if I've been using the worst arms for my setup, I'm going to be pissed off. <laughs> I'm going to be really pissed off. All right, time to go find out. I haven't missed a shot yet. Oops. Okay, I'm a fucking idiot. I will admit that I'm the biggest fucking idiot that has ever existed on the face of the planet. I've had the worst arms equipped for the loadout or the setup that I have. And everybody, everyone has suffered. Everyone has suffered for like 10 fucking streams and nobody's told me. Shit. That makes me sad. It makes me sad in ways I can't describe. God damn. Okay. Well, since we're here, we've got the rest of these arena fights to do to get up to the top of A rank. All right, Shade, he sent me some disparaging uh, uh, mail a couple streams ago. All right, very aggressive. This pilot wastes no time before going on the offensive. His strategy is one that combines hit-and-move tactics with an agile, well-outfitted AC. Pilots that hope to face the A-ranked Ravens must first defeat Shade. Few do, but he is A-ranked, so I'm facing an A-ranked Raven. Shut the fucking butt, butt, fuck. Let's go to the military district. Why not? See if these guys have OP intensifier equipped and they stay in the air the entire time. I want to see how well these arms do against, like, a real opponent instead of that asshole we just spent all our time dealing with. This guy's a real fast mover. Wow. Let's see. But the good news is you can't stay airborne like I can. So you can eat my ass. At least it doesn't seem like you can stay airborne like, airborne like I can. The difference this is making for me is fucking insane. I've never been angrier. I've never been angrier. Holy shit. Okay, so we're switching out these arms to all of our fucking ACs. Wow. Wow. Oh, I gotta do something for my wife. Give me one second. Dentist appointment is July 15th at 11 a.m. I'm thinking I'm back. 450,000 credits. This is why we're not concerned about ammo anymore, by the way. I cannot believe I've had the worst arms equipped. Mail. Mail from Shade. 
First of all, Arena Progress, congratulations on reaching the Arena's A ranks. We've prepared a part reward in recognition. MCL SS Ray Core Part. MCL SS Ray. It doesn't matter. What are you going to do with the knowledge that my daughter has a dentist appointment on July 15th? <laughs> okay, so I've got a new core. That battle was easily the finest I've ever taken part in. Thank you for the opportunity to match wits with such a worthy competitor. It has been too long. That's cool. A little respect. I like it. I like getting respect. Respect. Good do, good do, good do. All right, let's check out this core part. It's probably going to be a lightweight core part based on what we've gotten before. All right, where is it? Yeah, this thing. Look at exceptional overboost. This thing is like a speed demons thing <laughs> ask how my daughter's doctor appointment went my daughter has a doctor's appointment I don't understand I don't understand what's going on look at that thing that is a mid-range overboost lightweight part <laughs> 2477 versus 2800 and 1090. <laughs> I cannot believe how big of a fucking fool I've been. <laughs> Where's my good arm? Actually, what about this? That's 502, and it's got better armor points. That thing's got a... That thing's actually... This arm is really good. Wait, where... 5614 over 56. Okay. Huh. Well, that leads to the need to do more experimentation with this AC part. So I wonder if switching back over to... Actually, where is it? Yeah, that thing's a lot heavier in comparison to what we were dealing with there. So we've got this machine gun. There is a lighter machine gun I can equip. I just don't have it purchased. And let's see. We can obviously switch to that and we'll be way underweight. Hmm. Actually, if we do that, that would give us the opportunity to uh, basically equip a lot more heavy stuff on our AC. Like, I'm not really worried about the charge thing yet, but... Anyways, let's go back and finish up the arena, shall we? System, arena, arena, that's what I want. I want arena. Zero. Tried and true combat tactics have enabled this pilot to maintain his place among the arena's best. His AC is equipped with a variety of weapon types which he uses to great effect. He anxiously awaits the day he and Shatter meet face to face. I think Shatter is... Shatter's somewhere down here. Shatter. I think Shatter's, like, aim is to kill that guy. The guy in second place. Yep. Zero. All right, let's fight Zero. Let's look at his specs. He's got a ton of ammo. I wonder where that ammo comes from. I wonder if it's all from the machine guns he's got? It must be. All right. Let's fight you in... Train city, as in we gonna run a train on this city. Yeah, yeah. Hashtag Brick Squad. I don't know. Hashtag Fire Festival. Jesus. Oh, you're you're gonna be this kind of trouble, huh? Did you fly out of the level? Nope. You're still there. You're just a hell of a pilot. Your mobility options are really good. Or your mobility ability is very good, I should say. Oh, he's he's got the solid shell a, uh, EO uh, core equipped. That, uh, that thing is uh, genuinely interesting. He's still not having a great time of it. Then again, neither... Whoa! Where are you at? Where are you at? Really going to hide there? Fucking damn, these controls are kind of, uh... Oh, that's not what I want. Come on, a little more. Just a bit more. There we go. We got him. Win! You died!
we do it. That was a good fight. Like, having that extra um, uh, machine gun equipped on the right arm is just to cause a lot of damage right away in the beginning. Um, I've got the ammunition to just take care of him with just the right arm and maybe the EO core. Um, but uh, it's definitely nice to get him before I run out of ammo for that left arm part. All right, time to reach the number one rank in the arena, Mobus. Securing his position at the head of the arena, Mobius' only motive for continuing his training is to ensure that the skills which brought him this far do not diminish. Well then, as life goes on, you're going to become incredibly disappointed. Those who have tried to unseat him quickly learned why he is ranked number one. <clears throat> Alright, he's got a heavy grenade launcher, he's got a light missile launcher, and he's got a fairly decent laser rifle. <coughs> Alright, that felt better. Dying live on stream. Commenced this battle. Alright, this should go rather well. Woo, fuck you, buddy. Yeah, you stay on the outside there. Oh. As long as I can. Like, my issue is that I can't really outturn these guys, especially the higher ranked guys. My lack of an issue is the fact that they've. Woo! Fuck you, get the fuck out of here! Oh, you're dead! Oh, well, that, uh, that was the arena. Woo, we did it. We, we done killed him. Oh, he destroyed my left hand weapon. Wow. Uh, I don't even care about that. We did it! We beat another arena in another Armored Core Games. Our wieners are gigantic. <laughs> like, super huge. Like, you know, the, the wiener. All right, let's read what it says about us. His position at the head of the arena is the result of hard work and perseverance. Attaining this rank is no small feat. Holding on to it is another matter entirely. Just as he unseated his predecessor, others await their turn to do the same. We did it. We're the best. A couple people we can blow up down here at the bottom, but I'm not worried about them. I've got new mails. Several. One is from Mobus. I see you have finally reached the point where you are ready to challenge me. Many others have tried, but none of them were up to the task. I hope you will prove different. Well, I proved different. The courage you've displayed while rising through the ranks is admirable to say the least. When we meet, I promise to fight you with to my full potential and show you the respect you deserve. Hopefully, you will offer me the same courtesy and put forth your best effort when the time comes. Until then. So that guy's just interested in a good fight. Right, congratulations on your victory. You are now the arena's top-ranked pilot. A reward has been prepared for you in recognition of this incredible achievement. Please check your garage to receive the Mwiga Mwiga Finger right arm AC part. So now I can finger other ACs. We hope you find this gift useful. All right, let's go check out my new finger. <laughs> Let the fingering commence. Oh, what the fuck is that? Special quad barrel machine gun. I'm genuinely interested to see what the fuck this thing can do. Let's try it out on one of the newer people in the arena. How about this Virtue character here? Virtue and Brace often accompany, accompany each other on their mission assignments and work very effectively as a team. Although she is ranked slightly below Brace, Virtue is actually considered the better pilot, and many expect her to advance in rank. Well, you're about to get fingered, Virtue. Does that mean I'm going to take her Virtue? Wow. This has gone to a dark place. So I'm assuming it's a machine gun that fires four rounds per shot. And it's got 300 rounds because of the, the extra ammo holder I've got. Oh, sh Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. Oh, that's... Oh, wow. It's already out of ammo. It's already out of fucking ammo. Holy shit. That's, uh... Damn. Well, we fingered Virtue. Our finger ran out of ammo. 
That thing is like you can't you can't build an AC around that. You can't. You absolutely can't. If you even if you even miss like five shots, you're fucked. But let's see what's its weight in relation to everything else. Actually, really good. Like that thing is entirely a joke part. It's got to be. <laughs> ah, scratch my nose. <laughs> All right, we're gonna keep using our uh, machine gun AC here. Actually, assembly. See, I'm hoping we get that generator that they were talking about. That's got. <laughs> Energy output, 92. The fact that this thing has worse energy output is strange. So we got that. We've got this one, revised version of the KGP. Hmm. All right, so we don't have any new anything else at this point. So let's save and try a few more missions, shall we? <laughs> the fact that my, my air-based machine gun AC is doing so well against so many of these um, uh, mission enemies says a lot about the way that you can kind of break open this game towards the end. Old Laird. Secure Fortress NK-432. Pod MTs, Patrol MTs, Other Unknown. Destroy AI Mainframe Computer. Cudesto. Uh-oh. The cause remains unknown. The problem is affecting all AI controlled equipment from mobile defense units to stationary security devices. Ah, delicious wall time. Everything has gone haywire. To those facilities where the problem is most widespread, but the initial feedback we're receiving from them is not encouraging. Okay. That's an AC. Fortress NK 432 is the facility proving most difficult. With the craziest core part I have ever seen. What is that? I want it. I want whatever the fuck that is. What we require is the expertise that only a raven can offer. Please head to the fortress. I think Poseidon Tyrant died. Or fell asleep. Probably fell asleep. Okay. So we've got an AC coming with us, and it looks like we're fighting an AC. Oh, Eclair! Hi, Eclair. With your arm parts and your stealth shit. I hope you prove to be a useful teammate and not somebody who's going to turn on me and attempt to kill me. That would be upsetting. They did that a lot in the last game. In the last game, you, you your your AI buddy turned on you like 10 times. It was honestly genuinely annoying. All right, so since we're using a machine gun based AC, um, first of all, let's see. Okay, this head doesn't have a mapping function. Oh, that was... that was fine. What is this? I can see the shadow through the floor. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> nope. There we go. Open the door with our machine gun bullets. Hello to everyone who suddenly appeared. Thanks for uh, joining us. I'm Wu-Tang and we're playing some shit today. Like, I can't actually... There we go. <laughs> I had to waste a lot of ammo to get that working. Alright. My priority is... to not get hit. And using the, the EO core will go a long way towards helping with that. As long as they can actually hit their targets. Alright, I think they're just going to keep coming out. So let's... Damn it, and I wasted... Okay, no big deal. Whew, that'll be the only time we have to deal with that problem. I assure you. Oh, Jesus, fuck, fuck that, fuck that, fuck you, fuck everything that's happening. Oh, it's just the big ones. I just saw the explosion and got, uh, got skirt. We're doing alright, though. The fact that I've had to destroy all of this, though. Alright, so... What's the over-under on that big and AC in there? Chat, what do you think? Oh, no, it's... 
It's a button. I hit the button. Okay. What's next? Oop. All right, we've gone through there. That's where we came from. Right? I think that's where we came from. Yep, okay. If it hasn't been... Everything about this room says some shit is about to go down. Wow. Wow. Wow! What the fuck? What is this? Does anybody in the chat know what the hell I just did? Can y'all like... I hope... I hope I didn't just basically cost myself a million dollars. Wow, uh, that was unexpected. I genuinely hope that isn't going to become a problem here in the future. Alright, so that's where we went this time. I didn't think there were branching pads here, but it looks like there may very well be... Too bad those things can't shoot behind. Yeah, it looks like there are branching paths. Okay. Alright, we can deal with this. There's that same guy who's... For some reason, just up there. Alright, we're looking for a different door. Oh, there's a ramp! So we can just go upstairs here. Oops. These heavy guys are a serious problem. Luckily, they haven't proven to be that big of a problem. All right, we've got big door over there, small door over here. Uh, one of which I cannot unlock. There's something right on the other side of that door, and that's another door I can't unlock, so I guess I'm going this way. There we go. Just because of the way I'm set up, I don't have anything melee, so I kind of have to... What the fuck? Why would it do whatever it just did? That's stupid! It literally... <laughs> Why would it load in the middle of me getting fucking shot up? What is this? No, 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 no! No! Fuck that! Oh, God, that did so much damage to me. Woo! This is getting, uh... This is getting kind of ridiculous. I hope I never run into one of those rooms ever again. What's going on out here? Ooh! This is, uh... Raven! Do you copy? I can't advance until you've destroyed the controls! Yeah, no shit. I'm under attack! Hurry! Alright, do we have any more on the other side of the thing? It looks like it. Yeah, so I'm stuck here using my machine guns for all of this stuff. Got another one over there? Yeah, we do. Can I reach out and touch you from here? Yep. There we go. Alright. That's the one we want to do avoid. Woo! This is, uh... This is becoming dire. <laughs> dire. I wonder if we'll ever run into Sturezo. Alright, is this just a fucking AC fight? Okay, please, for the love of God, destroy the controls here. Because these things are going to hurt me. Actually, we've been doing all right. Use the EO core to conserve ammo. The problem with this one now is my... my uh, the damage I'm taking here. And I'm going to die here. Son of a bitch. This is the only mission we have, too, so we might have to equip something. If I didn't take that one fucking hit, uh, we would have been able to manage this, but... Uh... Alright, let's see. Am I gonna... Yep! Wow, what a what a crock of shit there. Yeah, no, I get it. I'm gonna build a heavy for this, I think. Build a heavy with a heavy EO core. That'll be good. Oh, well. I did say... At the beginning of this this game, at the beginning of Silent Line, once we get about halfway through the thing, we're probably going to get to a point where each mission is going to take two tries just to 
just to get us the the uh, the knowledge of the level since I'm basically running this blind at this point. This is a blind uh, uh, LP, basically. All right. <clears throat> Let's go over here to Shitty Salad, which is the name of the AC. All right. I do want that head equipped on it. Switch you out for a heavy core. Where's my heavy EO core? There you are. Optional parts unequipped. Oh, I gotta re-equip OP Intensify. Yep, there we go. All right, let's go back to a Sambuti. Switch these out for the good arms. I cannot believe I'd spent <laughs> so much time with bad arms, basically. All right, so there we've got our heavily armored, lightly equipped, well, heavily equipped AC here. Left arm missile launcher, close range flamethrower, napalm howitzer, left arm equipped howitzer, close range machine gun. I want to equip the howitzer. The thing is actually fairly great. High attack power sniper rifle, shit, with that amount of... All right, maybe equip this thing? I don't know. Maybe we'll equip a back-mounted machine gun. <laughs> just finger the enemies. <laughs> I can't believe they just named it Finger and made it look like a big angry fist. Not that I have any problems with the big angry fist. Right, equipping this and switching this out for a lighter setup up here. All right, where's our machine gun? There is our machine gun. Okay, we've got about 300 left to play around with. Which means... Can't equip that. We gotta be at 69. Ooh, even that's too much, wow. Okay. Let's see where we can, what we can do better from here. We're gonna have to equip the shittier generator. Cooling 69, cooling 77, or 115. You know, we don't actually need too much in the way of cooling. This thing is um, built pretty damn well uh, to deal with cooling here. All right. We've got, actually, we could keep that thing equipped. And we could switch to 405. 355. The boost power on that's good. Alright, we're over by 100. Which means... Just switching out to a lighter head that still has all the stuff I want. Map area place of name. Let's see, where's the one we had before? It was this one, with no memory. No memory. No biosensor or anything, though. Some of these heads are just no good. Sky Eye is still a pretty good. Sky Eye or this one. Probably this one. No biosensor, but I'm not really worried about bio stuff at this point. Alright, we're at 68 out of 69. So we can do a little more optimization here. Oh, we can go right back to the damn, the heavy boosters. We're still under by 50, wow. So we can actually equip these on here. All right, that's probably the best we're gonna get here. We've got gate, great per gate performance. We've got great performance. We've got an EO core to handle enemies. We've got plenty of um, defense. Defense points, 3,300. Where's energy defense? It doesn't actually just straight up show energy defense. Um, we've got some lighter weapons to take care of those smaller enemies, and we've got heavier weapons to deal with whatever comes our way, and that howitzer to open the doors. Okay. I'm actually going to maybe stick with this thing for a little bit. 
The only issue we'll have with this thing is if we run into an enemy AC. Uh, because since we're slow, I'm not going to be able to avoid hits as well as I would like to. Alright, save complete. Let's, uh, let's try this mission again. Hello to everybody who's uh, here hanging out, by the way. I hope you're uh, enjoying yourself. A few hours ago, the problem is emergency strike fortress yep, no, we got it. We are going to have to fight that AC. It looks like all it's got is... I think that's just a shitty um, energy weapon. All right, let's go. They come out with a new armored core, which it's E3 season, so we may get an announcement. Um, but if they come out with a new Armored Core game, they, uh, really need to, uh, we're not too slow. Eh, we're pretty slow compared to what we had. What's up with that? I don't know what's up with that. But, since I've got a better head, I've actually been, or I'm actually able to map this thing now. Not dead, trying to gauge your ears. Oh, that sounds, uh... Incredibly painful. Wow. You have to hit it exactly to get it open. Oops. Come on, shoot it. Damn it. Oh, that totally fucking works. Alright, so we've got this room here. But our best bet is going to be to just run right the fuck on through. Hopefully we don't take too much damage. Yeah, we did okay, I guess. There we go. It's working out okay, I guess. Okay, there's one down. Oops. Cool. That wasn't... That could have been uh, much worse. Alright, there we go. Having to destroy those damn locks is a tremendous pain in the ass. I ain't gonna lie. Alright, let's go back over here and destroy that room. I don't understand what the point was of that, but we're still gonna do it again. Because I want to see what happened. Whoops. No, open. There we go. And that'll blow up everything? No? That will. Hope you guys like explosions, because holy shit, this room exploding, it's either going to cost me like ten times what they're going to pay me, or it was like some crazy bonus thing that I'm going to get just for checking out the extra area. Uh, hopefully it's the ladder. The latter. Oh, there goes another howitzer around. No big. No big. I wish I could, um... I wish I could, like, open something from, like, further off in the distance. You know what I mean? Like, I wish I could point at a door and, like, hack it from a distance because... Those things are an incredible pain in the ass. And I really want to not get hit by them. Okay. That hallway where we got hit by the damn... Uh, uh, crazy laser thing. That was the... Uh, okay. That one's down. And another one over here? Yes, we do. Oops. Let's see. Hopefully that does it for you. Yep. And then this was the door where we had problems. No, here we go. I've got to, like, get close to it. So what I'm going to do... Oh, see? It does it because it wants to lock you into this room. No, there we go. I just want to get out of the room. That thing will get destroyed by that crazy energy cannon. Let's see. Let's watch it die. Oh, they don't take friendly? Shit! What am I doing with my life? 
The fact that that guy was able to avoid it, but I took the hit so hard the last time is incredibly frustrating. Oh, this is this room. Okay. Whoops. Nope, 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 nope. I want to stay. Yeah, no, I'm working on it. Shut up. Shut up. Deal with it. I'm working on it. I'll under your attack. I don't know what that means. I don't know what anything I'm saying means. That one's destroyed. Right, this is a good spot, I think. <laughs> Having to do all this aiming to destroy these things is kind of frustrating, if I'm going to be perfectly honest. It looks like I can cross here pretty safely. Yep. All right. Oh, wow. The other AC is almost dead. And it's my fault. It was me. I did this. Lock released. There Moving up. Destroyed. Oh, I'm an idiot! Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, so this was the room where she's going to have to do it now. So sitting in a corner with these things equipped is probably going to be the best way to, like, take care of dealing with these damn things. And then just kind of <laughs> raking the machine gun back and forth. Yeah, this is going much better than, like, jumping around and trying to avoid the hits. No fucking shoot it! Uh, having the EO core under... There we go. Now we're having problems. Where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? God damn it! The gate should be open. Move up. Okay, let's open it! Open it! Woo! Oh, God, these fucking things. Okay. We can do that. We can actually load it. Oh, my God. Get away from me. No! You're doing so much damage. Why are you doing so much damage? Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ! If I lose it here... No! No, you fucking son of a bitch! So much time wasted getting through this fucking bullshit to get fucking killed by you? Oh boy. Oh boy, fuck this. Oh boy, fuck this. Fuck! Son of a bitch. <laughs> no, we don't want to overwrite and save. Unless we can just skip that mission. Can we skip it? Can we skip it? We can skip the mission. Okay. Fuck it. We're saving. I don't want to fucking do that. I do not want to do that bullshit mission again. Fuck that mission. <laughs> Fuck everything about it. It's garbage. Fuck you if you like it. Fuck your couch. I'm grumpy. <laughs> Disable satellite cannon. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Raven, if you've received this request, you are one of the select few chosen to assist us on an upcoming assignment. So what I have to are destroy the satellite? The because I got to the end of the mission and got my shit pushed in. <laughs> That's why. Objective is to remove the threat posed by the satellite cannon. Oh my. Is to locate the generators that supply energy to the cannon and destroy them. Heavy resistance is expected. There's an AC. With the other ravens oh, ravens they've hired other ravens. Alright, what do we got? <laughs> Aw, thanks, Tyrant. I appreciate it. <laughs> Operation Code Inoculation. I don't get it. Alright, so here we are back in the giant laser cannon thing again. Oops. There we 
go. All right, I've got five minutes to basically rush this damn thing. Requesting mission. Everything okay? Wow, four shots from the Karasawa to destroy one of those things. Okay, that's uh, that's fine. Okay, two for those ones. It looks like there's a few more over here. Yeah, there is. Right, that one's down. That one's down. Seems like we have to really speed through here. Good news is I can kind of skip. No, skip! Are you really gonna fucking just block me in this damn doorway? One more. Well, I guess not. Hmm. We need to refill those exceed orbits. There we go. Okay. I'm ready to move up. I'm going after the generators now. Uh oh. The way they move is so much cooler than the way you're able to move. So we have to destroy all of these generators. Okay. Can do. Oh, there's an enemy too? They got behind me. Wow, these things are fast compared to me. Chain gun time. We have three minutes, so I have more than enough time to actually destroy this enemy AC and continue on. It's using stealth stuff. That's why I'm having a hard time with the targeting on it, though. Okay. Come on, where are you at? Okay, that one's done. Alright, time to just kind of slowly waltz through here. Take care of these damn thing. Damn it! It's like auto walking because my sticks are loose. All right. You know, being on level with them would probably help with just sweeping across them here. Got plenty of time. Oh, that does it in one shot. Cool! We beat a mission! How about that? It's almost like if you don't put an AC fight, a difficult AC fight, at the end of an incredibly long, incredibly damage-dealing mission, your players can fucking beat the mission. How nice. How nice of them. We actually made some money there. Oh, we got money for destroying the AC. That's good. I'll probably get it for beating it in such a good amount of time. Because I just basically avoided all the enemies and ran along. Alright, so we've got new mail. Uh, from Mirage and from Emissir. So let's read the facts from Mirage. Raven, the mission to destroy the satellite was a resounding success. Thanks again for taking part. In hindsight, much of the damage inflicted on both Layered and the surface world could have been avoided if something had been done sooner. Good job. Thankfully, our attempts to gain control of the satellite were not entirely in vain. Something interesting was noticed by one of our researchers when the data link was established. As it turns out, there is a striking similarity between the technology used in the satellite and that being provided to the corporations by the Artificial Intelligence Office. They were behind it all! <laughs> Even more unnerving is the similarity of both these technologies to that which was used by the controller. How in the world was the AIO able to procure such technology? So it seems like the artificial intelligence office, those are the bad guys. I don't know. Raven, although the exact point of origin was yet to be determined, the override signal was definitely transmitted from somewhere within the Silent Line region. The corporations are now starting what they know about 
sharing what they know about the AI malfunction and agree that technology provided to them by the AIO is somehow tied to the problem. Given the fact that all communications with the AIO ceased shortly after the incident, this theory can't be discounted. Sarah Cross's location is also unknown at this time. According to the corporations, all of their dealings with AIO were conducted remotely. None of them has ever met anyone from the organization face to face. So I wonder if the AIO is just a bunch of AI. Anyways, the corporations have agreed to a joint mission assignment bent on pinpointing the transmission source of the override signal. The Silent Line region is wrapped in mystery. Operating in the area is a dangerous proposition. At best, uh, please exercise caution. Cautition. Exercise cautition. All right, we're gonna save here so we can save scum later. I actually don't like how my uh, the heavy AC we built is uh, controlling. Uh, we're still gonna use it because it seems to have the best survivability next to my, my fast arena AC. Um, yeah. Secure unexplored region, 100,000 credits. Operation Area Silent Line. So we actually have to secure the Silent Line now, apparently. <laughs> Unmanned Patrol Units. Global Cortex recently received identical mission requests from each of the corporations. Damn. We've opted for a single mission in order to expedite the request and still meet all of their needs. Wow, you were pulled in off the street to do this voice recording, weren't you? Each of the corporations is interested in conducting a survey of the unexplored region. They want to determine the source of the signal that caused their AI equipment failures. Mm. Little is known about the area, but a cursory examination revealed that it is being patrolled by a large force of unmanned units. Oh, damn. Those are regular ass MTs, actually. Almost as if they were guarding something. Survey, we first need to remove the threat presented by the patrols. Head to the area and eliminate any targets you encounter. This voice actor is putting me to fucking sleep. All right. No consorts from the looks of it. Interesting. All right, time for Karasawa. I really like using the AO core in like a solid shell weapon. Maybe I'll switch to like a legit rifle or like a sniper rifle at some point and try that out. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna build a new AC after this. I'm gonna build an AC around a rifle build, a bipedal rifle build. I think that'll be cool. All right, if Thunder were here, Thunder would probably say, if you go into the thing, We'll be able to... Alright, that one's down. Alright, that one only took two shots, surprisingly. Alright, there's three shots on that one. Let's take out this one here. Okay, this is actually with the Karasawa going pretty well. Not gonna lie. Alright, that one's down. Alright, keep moving predictably so that I can shoot you. Wow, you dodged out of that one. Perfect timing. Well, let's see. Alright, that one's a three shot one. Alright, that one's down. Whoa! Actually running into trouble here now. Alright, switching over to the... Damn it. You're really just going to get yourself caught in there? Like, okay, that's fine. This is a hell of a fight. This is a good mission. This feels good. Poseidon is going swimming. Goodbye, Poseidon. Is that why your name is Poseidon? Because you swimming? Is that why that happened? I'm strange. I'm a strange little buoy. That one's down. We got any more coming from over here? No. I don't think we were supposed to have been able to destroy them this quick. We're going to have to deal with something serious here soon, I bet you. I guarantee it. You're a damn sea creature. Oh my god. Target approaching. There are two ACs. Why? I mean, okay, but why? Oh. 
Like, the fact that all of these kind of devolve into fight two ACs at once is uh, pretty annoying, to be perfectly honest. All right, let's switch over to the Karasawa here. Take out the big heavy one first. That one seems to be landing the most damage. And it's taking the most damage. Jesus Christ. Okay, there's one. <laughs> you got hit with the combo, bro. Alright, switch our exceed orbits back out. Okay, that was uh actually genuinely easy. Okay. Cool. Not too bad. Not too bad. Oh my god. Hey, it was worth it. So is that us clearing out the silent line? It sounds like it might have been, actually. I have new males. And I got a head part, Missed Eye. Investigation. Raven, an ancient fortress. An ancient fortress was discovered by reconnaissance patrols sent to investigate the area secured during your last mission. The fortress is located in an enormous cavern beneath a crater, and to our surprise, it appears to be in perfect working order. We've confirmed that the fortress is not the source of the override signal, but it does act as a relay. Gaining access to the fortress will not be easy, but we've come too far to stop now. The source of the override signal must be confirmed. The fortress is our best lead so far, and the corporations intend to take control of it as soon as possible. Once again, this will be a joint corporate operation. Even if, an, even if this mission is a success, has any thought been given as to the possible repercussions of our actions? What does that, what does that mean? What does that even mean? All right, we got a new head, and I want to I wanna rebuild Baconator. It was Mist Eye. Oh, that thing looks cool as fuck. Improved version of Sky Eye. No map, though, so worthless. Even though it's one of the coolest-looking ACs I've seen so far. All right. So I want to rebuild you into a mid-leg or a mid-weight leg AC. Probably 54 is going to be our best bet here. But if we can get something around 55, I think 61 would probably be good. But I do not want to go full heavy with this thing. So let's equip the 54 leg piece, which I believe is one of the leg pieces, one of the original leg pieces we bought, which is really cool. Uh, and let's see if there isn't anything better in the shop. Legs with a weight of 54. There's 6,000 there. We'll buy this. We've got, we've got money to burn. Maybe we'll go back to uh, reverse joint. Maybe we'll end up doing that. 56 on this one. Prototype blending armor and mobility. That's a cool that's a cool leg piece. I like that. All right. Hang on. I've got a I've got a uh, 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 like a local like municipal airport by my house. Um, and sometimes those things are just like, what are you doing? All right, this has 60 ammo. This has 80 ammo and does 788. Um, hmm. The range on these things is impressive. <laughs> All right, so that technically has 40 shots. That has 160 shots. That's actually a, a great weapon. <laughs> like I might actually end up going with the actual sniper rifle. We will see. All right. We'll equip a machine gun over here for funsies. And then in terms of the back, we can remove the machine gun and we can switch this to something else. Perhaps a missile build. Or, yeah, perhaps a missile build, actually. Releases cluster bombs. That's interesting. All right, so now we're dealing with the overweight issue of these damn missiles here. But first, let's actually switch out the head, because I don't want to keep the ultra-powerful head on, to be perfectly honest. Uh, got the good arms. Uh, 
Where's the good one? Where's the good one I like? Where's the one I likes how I likes it? This one's pretty good. Except no memory for the map. God damn. Tie is still like the best overall. Like it's got everything and it's got decent like AP and defense points. Where's the damn radar helmet? Yeah, see that thing, the the armor points is not good enough for me. The defense points going up is a lot better, but uh, it doesn't go up by much, so. All right, so with this setup, we're once again looking at, we can actually just straight up roll like this with a back machine gun, a rifle, the, this damn thing. Which I would almost want to switch out for something heavier. Releases independent weapon power. Oh. <laughs> you know what? We don't got a lot of power. But let's try this. Alright. This one's 505. This one's 788. Or wait. No. 350, 788, 510, 505. 782. The fact that that thing does so much damage is kind of cool. Um, let's see if we can't buy a better right-hand rifle to equip there. Some of those are pretty good. Rapid fire rifle. 310 with ammo of 150. We'll grab this. The weight on that was definitely right. Mid-range rifle with max ammunition. The weight on that's right. Sniper rifle with added ammo storage. That could be useful. Rapid fire sniper rifle. We're just gonna buy up all these rifles. I'm excited. I'm excited to try a rifle build. Uh, 350, 160, 310, 150. So except for the fact that it's rapid fire. Reload time 23 versus reload time 30. It's not that great. This one puts us overweight by just a tad, uh, which we can. <laughs> fixed by fucking with the extensions there. Um, 215 with 300 rounds. And a reload time of 25. That one's actually pretty good. 180 with the 40 shots. That thing that thing is built around uh, being used in the arena for sure. Especially if that ammo stuns. Uh, that would be really good for the arena. Right, so there's the super heavy one with all the extra ammo. What else did we buy? We bought this thing, which once again has us overweight by just a little bit. 540 and 80. 788 and 80. What's the point of this one, then? Seems like there is no point to it. The ammo is low, or the attack power is low, but that actually might end up being incredibly useful. All right. We're going to try this. Let's switch over to our energy extensions. The fact that the stealth thing is 602 uh, weight is crazy. All right, where are you? There you are. And I'm overweight by six. Fucking six. Where do I lose six? I guess I could switch away from that machine gun to, some, to anything else. Since I do have a machine gun. A missile launcher, maybe? I wonder if this is a missile launcher. It's a hand missile. <laughs> okay, so we've got a rifle, a, a, an automatic weapons pod, a missile launcher, and a machine gun. That thing is kind of insane that we have just built here. <laughs> With fair performance, fuck you. Let's try that thing out in the arena, actually. We've got some guys down here we can beat. Let's beat freedom! A raven who is unable to fight to his true potential unless he feels cornered or threatened. The more dangerous the situation becomes, the better he performs. His matches are popular as they often feature last minute comebacks. Let's do this in the arena, shall we? So I've got a rifle in one hand and a machine gun in the other. I'm interested to see how this plays out. <laughs> You know, the, 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 the fire rate on that thing is actually not bad at all. And having the missile there is kind of ridiculous, to be perfectly honest. 
It's no machine gun, but that would probably work really well for... Um... That would probably work really well for... Uh, uh, for a, a, a mission here. So you know what? I like this build. I like what we've done with this thing. Um, while it has middling stats, technically, um, the fact that it is so versatile and has so much ammo with all the different weapons it has um, might actually go a long way towards helping us out. You know what? I want to try this a few more times. I want to fuck around with the, uh, the automatic... Uh, pod launcher and everything like that. Normally he is a very sensible person, but as soon as he straps into his AC, something changes. Most of his competitors attribute this change to a bad case of nerves, but no one really knows for sure. He would do better if he could relax. Okay, we're gonna fight this guy with our mission-specific AC here, which is actually done pre I mean, that was okay for a low-level fight. And obviously this thing isn't designed around competing in the arena. All right. Oh. All right. Do this in the EO core. Yeah, this is not doing shit. Ha <laughs> ha Oh, that's dumb. I love it. It's not working at all. That accurate fire of his is crazy. And the missile launcher clearly isn't good for that. Okay. So I've learned my lesson about non-machine gun builds in the arena. Maybe that rifle will be good for a mission. I'm not sure. We will find out next. Um, I'm going to take a short break here to take care of some laundry and get some drinks. Maybe get a lunch in me. Uh, so if you guys could bear with me, I would appreciate it. I'll be back in less than two minutes. Toulou. I apologize for saying toodaloo. That was incredibly unprofessional, and I think all of you are very upset with me for actually going along and saying that, and I'm probably going to mute myself at some point while I'm talking here. Because
Um. Um. Mm. Hey guys, I'm back. Grab myself a little handful of sunflower seeds, cause you know why the fuck not? Whew. Anyways, so we built ourselves what is probably going to be a disaster of an AC here. Super low defense and a bunch of weapons and shit. So let's see how big of a disaster this becomes. Almost two million credits. All right, let's continue on with the mission, shall we? Destroy power core. High-end MTs and shit. Whoops. Preparations are being made for a massive assault on an old fortress discovered by one of our recon teams. I thought it was underground. Our mission objective is to destroy the reactor core that provides power to the facility. Once this is complete, a research team can be sent in to investigate. Cool. Once the investigation begins, it is hoped that we can... I fucking unmuted myself. Yeah, I did. Who knows? Who cares? I don't care. Just pay me. Fuck you. Pay me. Aside from the fact that a reactor core powers the fortress, we have no other information to offer regarding the facility's layout or defenses. Proceed with caution. I'm gonna get fucked up. I'm gonna get fucked up with this <laughs> shitty AC I've built. <laughs> it's not gonna do good at all. Like at this point in the game, you pretty much have to switch to something that does a retarded amount of damage. And can take some hits. The core is top priority. So find and destroy that core. Okay. I'm trying to move, but you're still got me in a cutscene. It's frankly incredibly annoying. Alright, the enemies are through here. Nothing over here yet. Jesus Christ. Okay, it went down okay, but I'm I'm actually not liking the way that missile controls. The the rifle is uh, not doing too bad. Those things take a ton of damage. All right, so we've got a why did I suddenly fire a fucking missile there? Whoops. All right, we're gonna come through here and get our AO cores out, or EO cores out, excuse me. I'm taking a massive amount of damage for this fight. Okay, we destroyed that. Some of these are open, some of these are not. Interesting. And I've gone through my hand missile at this point. So I, I bet we're going to do this. I bet we're going to have to do this mission twice. What is this? Okay, I did something. Shit, what is this? Jesus, Jesus. These things are brutal. They're the little disorder units from the, from the second game. And they just won't stop coming. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Must escape. Jeez, man. Okay, so what's next? I came in here through that door. All right, here's another door that's open. We've got, what, 10 minutes total to find our way around this and take care of everything we need to take care of? Sector A18 clear. It's impassable. Woo, let's get the fuck out of here. Alright, so that's... There's is that opening here. these other doors? Yeah, it is. Okay. So here's the center one. This is what we were trying for here. The fact that these things do such an, so much fucking damage because of their energy weapons is crazy. We 
took out one of them. Jesus, man. This is not the way... Okay. So we had fun with our AC build. Sector N04 clear. Well, like, clearly we need more than this setup for these end game missions. Uh-oh. Oh, just, uh... Oh, no, not... Not this room. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck that. Fuck the things that are happening in this room. Someone needs to open this goddamn door. Save me. Save me. Save me from the nothing I've become. Wake me up. I can't wake up. I didn't sleep very well. All right. Another one of these fucking rooms? Let's hope these things will... <laughs> oh, we're dead. We're fucking dead. Yep, so... We got a little... We know a little more of what we need to expect here. And what we need to expect is the fact that these things are going to fucking push our shit in because we're going to be stuck in here with these shotgun energy wielding things. Oh, wow, I got a game over for that one. Shit. All right, we're going to try this one one more time. And if we can't get it, we're going to have to unfortunately conclude this stream with that fail. Um, not the end of the world. Um, we made a lot of progress. We definitely didn't get to the end of the game here like I expected we would be able to. But what are you going to do? All right, so first things first, we need to get rid of that horrible uh, bipedal build. Because that thing just does not cut it. It was a fun idea, but nothing good came of it. We got in the way of reverse joints, I wonder. Extra armor points that thing gets is great, but... Still not as great as the overall performance we had from... Wow, even these things are, like, better. Interesting. Go over to the 55. Still got the good arm, the good thing, the good head. <laughs> good head. <laughs> wonder if a laser cannon would be worth it. I wonder, I wonder... First things first, let's get rid of that damn thing. Because <clears throat> that clearly does not have the, the damage we're looking for from a weapon. In fact, honestly, that Kurosawa setup was the best thing we've been able to produce so far. <laughs> for missions, anyways. Dual energy rounds. Nope. Actually, that thing was probably the best we've had so far. Alright, that puts us way over. See, we can't use that with, like, other weapons. It's, like, terribly depressing. If we switch to that, it's okay, but we still need to get rid of a bunch of weight somewhere. That gets us close, but no cigar. That's the lightest weight that thing we're ever going to get. 27. Hmm. I wonder what our solution is here. <laughs> that thing can be used. Or barrel energy cannon. It's got five shots. It's worthless. That's got us way overweight. Of course, all that stuff's going to have us way overweight. This little shoulder piece has gotten us through so much. We're still overweight by 50. Where can we get rid of 50? I mean, we can get rid of 50 here. 
Like switching back to the howitzer does it, but then we've got the same setup that we've had pretty much forever now. Maybe a dual machine gun setup. I don't know. I don't know. Let's look at some left-hand weapons we can equip here. Like a rifle or something. Medium damage. Sniper rifle with emphasis on attack. You know, I should just buy these damn things. Just to have them. Hard-hitting left arm bazooka. Widespread shot pattern. A shotgun, maybe. Enhanced attack power howitzer. Spread shot howitzer. That might be an interesting try. Heavy left arm howitzer. Left arm rocket launcher. Lightweight left arm pulse rifle. Hmm. <laughs> Defense enhancing energy shield. And then those are just shields at that point. I wonder how a shield build would work for us. 390. Energy drain is 8. Energy drain is 6. What do we got? Nothing good. Energy drain. Okay, that's an energy shield. Top rated solid shell defense. Shield coverage 73. Shield coverage 90. I'm actually interested in trying out a shield. Why not? That'll free up some weight for other stuff too. Alright, so there's our left arm shield, which we should be able to just fucking toggle, honestly. Um. That frees up actually quite a bit of weight for something. What can we do? What can we do? We can replace you with something heavier. Not that much heavier. That would be nice to jam some of them things on there. Jam a second machine gun. Hmm. No, I want something hard hitting. Rockets are definitely good along the way of hard hitting. Why not? I'm sure we can rocket something to death. Actually, no, I really don't like the way rockets handle in this game. Just because of the way the game controls. I know I'm probably being, like, far too picky. Hmm... Add ammo, 20% more ammo. That might be useful for this. Just extra ammo for our laser rifle and our machine gun. <sighs> hum, 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 hum. You know what? We'll equip this, and we'll use this as an opportunity to equip, like, a better head. Switch back to this bad boy. Switch out better extensions. Not really worried about missile coverage. All these damn things are... Like, I have all these damn things, but I haven't touched them most of the time. Other radiator, jam enemy... <laughs> How funny would that be? Enhanced shielding. Is there an extension we can buy that is shielding without energy use? Energy drain six. Yeah, there is. We got that one we can buy. Just increase the shielding so that we take little to no damage. That would be kind of funny, actually. Thing is, now we still have more weight to play with. I wish there was something, you know, slightly better than that. Hmm. It's not better, though. Neither is that. Like, that would almost do it. Hmm. Something in that range. There's got to be something between that 
and that. Because with that, I get, I've got almost 200 extra weight, extra weight to deal with. Go back to our damn energy rifles, see if there isn't something we can buy. Be great if those bazookas were useful for this kind of for this game. I found that they aren't, though, unfortunately. All right, we've got another lightweight laser rifle, of which we already have one kind. Hum. Five twenty with twenty. Five twenty with ten. See, I didn't even need this because this is the one I would want to equip. So if we equip that and then go back to the lighter weight head, that's guy I tie. That pretty much does it. So we've got okay. So we've got a machine gun. We've got a, a, a mid-range laser rifle on the shoulder, and we've got this heavy laser rifle to deal with fucking everything else. And it actually has good performance, according to this stuff. They really, they don't take mobility into account when they talk about performance in these damn games. Um, they really take into account, like, how much damage you can take and how much damage you can deal out and those are the those are the biggest uh, factors so the only reason that thing's even labeled good is because that right arm cannon does does just stupid amounts of damage all right let's try this last try for the stream come on guys we can we can do this and by we I mean me and by can do this I mean are gonna lose I don't know Let's do it. It's interesting that by them just increasing the the, the in-game chatter, um, spread out. Uh, they're able to give us this this feeling that a lot more is going on. The only thing bad with this plasma cannon is this tiny ass little. Right, where's the door? There's the door. Still takes two fucking shots. One shot with an EO core, though. That does it. Sector A01, clear. So we've got a door There's to the right, and that's here. the only door. Got it. Roger. Keep looking. All right, I should probably take my time through these, but um, I'm genuinely more concerned about. Um, Took so much damage there. This is still going better than when we were doing this with the rifle setup. Luckily. Alright. Alright, the good news is, like, the way we do that, we can avoid dealing with those things. Just by sliding in, hitting the button, and sliding out, you know? Um, yeah. So this one was down here. So we'll slide in, slap it, and slide out. Hit the button, slide out. Okay, and this will give us some health to deal with these fucking... Okay, I actually have to... Okay. By doing that in the extension... Okay, now my shielding's up. I didn't actually have my shielding up before. Okay, it looks like the pulse cannon does enough. It's actually... This is doing okay. This is doing okay. Keep the shield up. We're not really dealing with much of a charge drain here. Woo. 
problem is that thing I have on my arm is an energy weapon. So using those with the EO is uh, bad. Because <laughs> I can get one off and then the EOs are sitting there sputtering trying to take care of everything. Alright, we're going into this next spot with a fair amount more health than uh, what we did last time. Alright, so here's where we had the issue last time. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put myself in this fucking corner. And use my little, my little mini thing here. Uh, chain gun is actually going to be the better setup for this. Let the EO do their job. As long as we can take them out before they actually... Alright, come on. Alright. So we're going to sit our happy asses here and let that charge build back up, because holy shit. <laughs> the fact that I went through all that is kind of bad. Um, I want to have some machine gun left for the damn... What did I just do? I want to keep the extension and the shield up. We can't hit that button. We've got to keep it up. Having the extra shield has gone a long way towards our survivability here. The problem is I have to hit it to open the damn door. Right, so let's slide ourselves into a corner again. Put our shield up. Alright. Alright, this is going well. Oh shit. There's that one right there. <laughs> Turning myself into just a turret is, uh. <laughs> Look at this. Crap. That was the last one I had to deal with. And this door is open. Shit! Come on! These were the guys that killed me, wasn't it? Last time? I think so. Alright, maybe I should have equipped two chain guns on this thing. I don't know. Look at that! Let's go. Let's go! I bet there's a button I have to press. And I'm wasting time by not pressing it? Yep. Okay, less than five minutes to do whatever it is they want us to do here. Now, here. One of the problems I have now, also... Trying to hit that damn thing across the way. Okay, good. That one's down. Now for these little fire. Oh, they refilled our uh, ammo and health. How about that? All right, are you just going to keep sliding around here? Because I can, uh, you know. If you're going to be predictable, I mean, I might as well take advantage of you. Ammo, Only problem is that I still have a time limit here I have to deal with. Shit. How many doors? Jesus, these things are a fucking mess. God damn. Woo. We just lost barbed wire. Well, it's a good thing. Shit. Shit. I didn't even I didn't even see you guys there. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. And having that shield up has gone a really long way towards keeping us alive. Um, shit! Alright. These fuckers, though. God damn. Okay, I've got three minutes left. It's, like, it's gonna be around this corner. There's gonna be two of them. Watch. Oh no, no kidding. Come on, come on. Uh oh. That's not a door, and I've got two minutes and fifty seconds left to deal with. Where am I supposed to go? 
Aha! Is this the way? Yep. Hopefully no more of those um, UAV nightmares. Speak of the fucking devil, eh? Jinxed myself. I jinxed it. Alright, those things are shooting at something. Where am I going? God damn it, there's another fucking... These goddamn buttons. Sometimes you get on the elevator and goes. Sometimes there's a button. Oh, I heard... I heard their energy gauge. So our energy gauges aren't working, apparently? So they're gonna drain our energy? Oh, shit. Fuck that. Oh, wow, we got it. Is that it? Now I've got to destroy this. I got something for you. Out of ammo for that. We did it! Hey, look at that! Second time's the charm in every try. Alright, we destroyed the reactor room. We did it. So it's a good successful mission to end off the stream. That's what I like. That makes me happy. This was a good... We're going to toy with this build a lot more, but this was a really good setup for what we were trying to do here. Um, maybe get a different um, right hand with some more damage or something like that. Um, or maybe a little less damage, but more ammo. But um, that seemed to go really well. I have new mail. What do we got? Emissary is layered. Raven, the override signal's point of origin has finally been cons confirmed. A tunnel was discovered in the fortress. We were shocked to discover where it led. Raven, we found the remains of another Layered. Okay, so Layered was the city from the third game that was underground that we existed in, so basically there was another one. So this is some Gurren Lagan shit. The answers to all that has happened recently must all that has happened recently must lie somewhere in the depths. But will these answers spell our doom or grant us new hope? It's up to you to find out. Be careful, Raven. So we are rapidly approaching the end of the game, I'm assuming. Unexplored region. Attack unexplored region. If that's the last mission, I'm going to be fucking grumpy. But, um... No, usually they throw a bunch of crazy shit at us towards the end of the game. And granted, some of these missions have been crazy. Uh, it's nothing like what I would expect from the end game of, uh, of a, a, a mainline uh, Armored Core game. So we're going to save here, and we are going to conclude the stream for the day. Uh, so with our conclusion, I want to thank everybody who came out. Um, I really appreciate you guys coming out and spending time on my channel. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, you should definitely leave a follow. Um, if you want to catch this again or catch any of our other streams, they're all archived on our YouTube channel, which you can find in the links below. We also do um, full Let's Plays and funny one-off videos over there as well. So if that type of thing interests you, you should definitely subscribe over there. Um, you should follow us on Twitter for updates on when our new streams are coming out um, and what we're streaming and stuff like that. You can find that in the links below. Uh, we also do dumb shit posting over there as well, which should hopefully interest some of you. If, if you're interested in my stream, you're probably going to be interested in shit posts. Anyways, once again, I'm Jeff. Thanks for coming out. Uh, I hopefully will see you guys next time. Goodbye.